All right, I came in the back door off that deck and it's right there. And you come into this little breezeway sunroom entrance area. I'm guessing at one time this was probably their back porch just because of the brick and that old window opening to the kitchen. Let's see. It does have definitely updated vinyl windows. They have nice marble sills. And this is actually, it looks like tile but this is actually a linoleum floor in here. Your laundry room is in here. You've got some extra shelves on both sides. Lots of windows in this house, lots of natural light, which is nice. So this is our kitchen. Cabinets were probably oak at one time now. Of course, they're still oak, but they've been painted. Countertop is in really good shape. It is a Formica countertop. And you have quite a bit of cabinet space in this kitchen. Tile floor. Looks like it's in good shape. I don't see any cracked tile. I don't see any grout lines that have chipped out or anything crazy. Double stainless stink. Electric stove. So you do have real hardwood floors. This is your formal dining room. It's got nice crown molding. We've got a little little bubble here in the ceiling like perhaps they had a leak at one time maybe before the roof was replaced but it looks to be completely dry now The floors have a couple of little scuffs and things on them. You can kind of see them in the glare there. Which if you didn't like the character, we could certainly, you could always refinish your hardwood floor. It has a wood burning fireplace, which would definitely have to be inspected before it was used. All these built in shelves. This room does have paneling that's been painted. I guess this would be your formal living room. This is actually the front door of the house on that front porch. You've got a little coat closet to the side. A little area here where you could put a bench or something to take shoes off or a coat rack. So the front door actually comes into the living room. This is one of the bedrooms on the main floor. Has the same hardwood floor. The paint is in really good shape. In fact, it almost looks like they repainted. Oh, maybe not. There's a one nail. I finally found a nail. They must not have had much hanging on the walls. There's one other. Just a small closet, maybe four and a half feet wide, four feet wide, two feet deep. Has some wire shelving. guest bathroom has a little oops 
little vanity area. It's kind of neat. They actually put working shutters on their vanity. But it has an upper and lower vanity area. What looks like a brand new pedestal sink. They have a cast iron tub, which is in pretty good shape. And then they have a fiberglass surround around it. Big hall closet with some duct work in it. That is an access panel to the back side of the plumbing on that shower in case you ever had to do repair. This front bedroom actually has a bunch of built-in shelves. Would really lend itself well for an office with all that shelving. And that's the entire first floor of the house.